Hi guys, and in this video I'll be swatching Jane or Del Beyond Matte Foundation, which I am obsessed with. I love it. I kid you not. I wasn't sure if I was gonna like it because um, Sales Representative recommended this as their new release for our spa to carry it, and I'm like, okay. If I wasn't familiar with Jane and Del brand, so I'm like, okay, I'll try whatever formulation you recommend. Now, I've used before Estee Lauder, I've used, I use, I still use MAC for certain applications, and I sometimes complement these two because this is more like a medium. It is buildable. It can be from sheer to medium to fill full coverage and it says it's 3-in-1, it's concealer, foundation and what was the other one? <laughs> Moisturizer? Oh, and primer? Yes, primer. Gosh. So, um, I'm gonna... This is my shade M5 that I'm wearing right now, guys. And I think it matches me pretty well. So maybe I'll start swatching from number one to all the way number 12. Let's hope there is gonna be enough of space for my hands. If you're wondering if you should buy this foundation, you should. I have uh, oily skin. I also use always pure pressed. So maybe if you use that alone, it wouldn't be as great result, but I use pure pressed and bis. And I use Nude um, 30 SPF powder and I use translucent on occasion and one which is fair neutral. And by the way, the foundation doesn't really have any smell of anything, it's sort of like maybe it's a little nice small smell. The second is fair to light with peach yellow undertone. Number three was light to medium with peach undertone and number four light and medium with neutral undertone. Number five is my uh, light to medium with gold undertone because I have gold undertone. I know it's not blended, it's not sure, but number six medium with peach gold undertone. Number seven will be medium with beige undertone. Number eight is medium neutral. Number nine, medium to dark with brown gold undertone. Number 10, medium to dark with gold peach brown undertone. Number 11, dark with peach pink undertone. Number 12, dark with peach yellow undertone. Now, didn't feel that was that dark, but let's go number 13, very dark with gold brown undertone. And now we'll move on to 15, deep brown with sienna undertone. Um, number 16, deep brown, deeper brown with red undertone. Number 17, deeper rich with chocolate brown with red undertone. And 18, deeper rich chocolate brown with neutral undertone. There you go, guys. The whole array of colors. Now, of course, it's better if you blend it out. Uh, but you can see how full coverage it can be if you pack up a lot of products. Now, of course, you're not gonna wear this level, but um, I love this foundation personally. It's my daily go to, and like I said, I do use MAC still because MAC is 24 hour wear. This is not gonna be that long wear, but it is pretty long day. It lasts me by the time I get home from work. If I don't go to work, it lasts even up to midnight if I wanted to. Because, you know, we have less sweating, less moving, less outdoor elements and all that stuff. But it's really good. It's primer, concealer, foundation in one, and it's not comedogenic. To trying to find your perfect shade, I hope this helps sometimes, you know, from... And I have to say, it looks great on camera still. Now I'm gonna blend this. Check this out. Now, it's worth mentioning that it has skin love ingredients like celery seed, linseed extract, tamarind extract, and a 
enhances the appearance of skin of acidity, smooth of moisturizes the skin. It also reduces the appearance of pores and shine, and it's free of tall fragrance like always, GMO, parabens, non-animal tested, sensitization tested, dermatologist tested, clinically tested. To be honest guys, a lot of people think that I don't wear foundation or to wear this foundation and say, oh your skin is so great, I'm like, okay. Well, let me know guys if you have any questions regarding this foundation since I've been using daily, really love clean mineral foundation with acne skin, I feel like it never ever um, uh, makes my skin break out, it's great. And consistency is very light, like feather light weight. Um, haven't used the uh, Jane Ardell, that little one, the bubble ones, that like the you know, thing, so I'm gonna try that sometime. Let me know if you tried it in the comments down below. I hope you guys enjoy this video. Please subscribe, like, and I'll see you next time. Bye!